ahead of President Muhammad Buhari's medical trip to London, United Kingdom. His wife, his children have left Nigeria for European country. So her report has gathered that Aisha Buhari, wife of the president, is also expected to join them today. All President Muhammad Buhari's children have moved to London in advance of his medical trip. He will travel anytime from now. His wife Aisha has joined the children today, a source we told Sahara reporters. The presidency had earlier announced the postponement of Buhari's medical trip to London earlier scheduled for Friday. Special Advisor on Media and Publicity Femi Adeshino did not give reasons for the postponement in a statement he issued. The statement only said a new date will be announced in due course. Buhari and members of his family routinely traveled to the UK for medical treatment amidst the you know, abysmal state of healthcare and poorly equipped hospitals in Nigeria. In March, the Nigerian leader went to the UK for what the presidency described as a routine checkup. The trip sparked off a controversy as it coincided, you know, coincided with the strike of the National Association of Resident Doctors. Since he assumed office on May 29, 2015, Buhari has embarked on medical trip abroad at least five times, you know, covering a period of no fewer than 170 days of the five years he had been in power. The following is a timeline of the president's trip for medical treatment. On February 5 to 10, 2016, the president took a six-day vacation in the United Kingdom, saying that his doctor lived in England. Between June 6 and 19, 2016, Buhari went on a 10-day medical trip to England for an air infection surgery. He extended his trip by three days to rest. On January 19, 2017, the president was back in London again on a medical vacation. On February 5, 2017, he wrote to the National Assembly seeking an extension of his London medical leave. Later, on March 10, 2017, Buhari returned to Nigeria but didn't resume work immediately at Asuru Villa. The presidency had claimed that he was working from home. On May 7, 2017, Buhari embarked on a trip to London for another medical vacation. He returned after 104 days, the longest he had stayed outside the country. On August 19, 2017, Buhari returned to Nigeria and it took him a while to resume work because Rat had you know, purposely damaged furniture in his office. The presidency therefore announced that he will be working from home. On May 8, 2018, Buhari went to London for a four-day medical review. On April 26, 2019, Buhari again left for the UK on a 10-day private visit to seek medical care. He came back to the country on May 5. Also, from March 30th to April 6, 2021, the president embarked on another trip for a routine medical checkup in London. What is your thought about what has been said? We have seen the outline of the president's medical you know, trip to you know UK for his medical checkup since he has assumed office as the president of Nigeria. Ahead of the president Muhammad Buhari's medical trip to London, we have heard that his wife his children have left Nigeria for the European Union, in European country, pardon. Sahara reporters gathered that Aisha Buhari, wife of the president, is also expected to join them today. What is your thought about what has been said? We have had Aisha Buhari and you know their children move to London ahead of the Nigerian president's second medical trip you know, in 2021. This is the second time the president of Nigeria is going on a medical trip. And this 2021, what is your thought about this? Don't you think it's high time the president do something about the you know local hospitals in Nigeria? Why can't he you know invest in the local hospital perhaps in Abuja, of which he can construct to the standard of which you'll be able to you know take care of his medical status? What is your thought about this? Don't you think for the president to start going out of the country? For medical checkup, don't you think is a slap to the country itself? Don't you think is an embarrassment to the, you know, to the Nigerian government? 
What is your thought about this? I'd like you to drop your thoughts and comment on what has been said. But before we go, let's see people's reactions and know their thoughts about this. Umwan Gaga, Henry reacted to this and said, This is why we keep on borrowing. You could have told us that you came for treatment, not for leadership. Same you said when you became president that our hospitals will be you know, standard, that no one goes out for treatment. But today, ordinary Qatar or headache, you are in London. Seems the Bible and Quran you guys are using in taking oath before you assume office is no longer effective. Maybe we will need to involve Ogun or Ahmad Yoha the next time. What is your thought about what has been said? We can see that one Gaga is not happy about the present situation of things. We can see that you should have told us, you know, initially that you are coming to Nigeria to, you know, take treatment and not for leadership. You should have told us that you came for treatment and not for leadership. During the campaign, you said you, you know, upgrade the Nigerian hospitals to the standard that no one will be able or no one would you know wants to go outside for treatment but today ordinary Qatar or headache for the president you are already in london it seems the bible and quran you use in taking oath before assuming office does not you know is not effective again probably we will need to involve ogun or ahmad yoha next time what is your thought about this we would like you to drop your thoughts and comment on what has been said instead of the president to invest in nigeria and make sure that the hospitals in nigeria are up to the standard that no one goes out of nigeria for treatment but he has refused he would rather continue to go out you know to sponsor his own medical trip what is your thought about this this is a disgrace to the nigerian you know government this is a, a huge disgrace for the president of a whole country going to another country for medical treatment do you think these people will take nigeria as a laughing stock do you think it's high time we need to do something about the present situation do you think nigeria is falling presently now instead of us to invest in our you know in our local hospital perhaps those ones in abuja that could be you know upgraded to the standard of which no one will be going out of nigeria to take medical you know care outside nigeria but no what we know how to do is you know self-centeredness we are used to self-centeredness our government are greedy they prefer going out of nigeria to seek medical attention don't you think that's a slap to the president himself for him going out to take treatment whereas he has a country who has you know qualified doctors who have qualified you know surgeons who can operate on him but no we have rendered the expertise in Nigeria, we have rendered them useless because there is not effective, you know, our standard hospital of which they can operate in. That is why when these doctors have the opportunity of leaving Nigeria, none of them will plan to come back to Nigeria because Nigeria is really killing their career, Nigeria is killing their destiny. If you are in Nigeria, you cannot blow. It has been said by so many people. What is your thought about this? Don't you think it's high time we wake up from our slumber and do something about the medical centers in Nigeria? None of them is up to standard. None of them is up to standard. That is why the president is going out of you know the country to take medical care outside. Don't you think it's time for the president to come back and realize that he needs to do something about the present situation of things in the medical care center of Nigeria? What is your thoughts about this? We'd like you to drop your thoughts and comment on what has been said. We'd like you to share your own point of view with us on this that has been said. We have heard about the president's wife, Aisha Buhari, and you know her children who are moving to London ahead of the president on his second medical trip in London. What is your thoughts about this? We'd like you to share your thoughts via the comment section. Thank you guys for listening. Do subscribe to this channel if you have not, and I'll see you on the other news. Bye for now.